guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Jen, this is just Jen's things. We are back in my vanity today for another video. You guys will probably see I'm wearing like a Hawaiian print dress and these glasses, whatever. You guys will see a lot of this <laughs> uh, for the next couple of videos. I'm trying to pre-film some videos just because I have the energy and the gumption to finally film right now and why not get a few videos out for you in the process so as you guys have noticed for probably the last four or five days i haven't filmed i haven't really posted anything i have been just surviving i guess is the best way to kind of say i've just been surviving um being a full-time caregiver for my mom and watching her decline has been really emotional for me. Um, I'm trying not to share as much of my mom um, because there are family members that um, feel very conflicted about it. They don't like it too much. Um, I try to only post the good things and the positive things about my mom. Um, but lately things have been um, kind of heartbreaking for our family and for me. Um, but we are pushing through um, health-wise. Mom is in good health. Um, she's just declining and going and transitioning into a different stage of her Alzheimer's. And it is just kind of taken a toll on me watching her change so swiftly. But as one of my most amazing friends here on YouTube reminded me, I'm not alone. I have made some really incredible friends um, here on YouTube and on Instagram. And um, you know who you are. You reached out to me today when I really, really needed it. And it gave me the gumption to get up and to you know take some time for myself shower, curl my hair, and try to remember that, how do I say it? We're all going through something, and a lot more than not, there are a lot of times where we all have gone through something that can help someone else too. So, I'm just gonna leave it at that. That's my little, you know, sob story update. Um, I'm okay. I just haven't really left the house. I, I haven't. Um, so I never got around to going back into the store to uh, look at the new collection that has come out. Um, I haven't gone ahead and done some of that, but I did place an order for the mini sale. So I'll probably go into the store possibly tomorrow and look and kind of, you know, remember, I mean, I do this because these things, Bath and Body Works, candles, hygiene, perfume, these are the things that make me smile. And during this caregiving journey, I need to remember that I have to take those moments where I can remind myself about laughing and laughter and being happy and smiling and doing some of those creative things that I love to do and I have to take those moments for myself and then not feel guilty about them um so thank you guys for listening to my four minute spiel about that and let's jump on in into today's video so I am doing my March empties early because I have this huge metal hamper that I always keep right under here under my vanity it is full to the brim. So March was incredible for my empties and for my declutters. There is so much in here that I, I mean, I know we're still a couple of days away from April. April's Monday. I'm filming this on, you know, Tuesday. There's just so much in here. I just need to kind of post the video so I can go ahead and get it out of the house. So that's what we're going to do today. Took me five minutes to say we're going to have an empties video. Thank you guys for watching. Let's jump right on in. So the first thing I, um, so I have my big, huge hamper, and then I just have a huge, empty Bath and Body Works bag right here. My tripod's moving because that's what happens. 
Um, the first thing we finished off was a candle in Butterfly. I really love this one. And this was from 22. And it's Raspberry Nectar, Iris Petals, and Airy Vanilla. It was kind of like a really dirty candle, I would say. Um, smells really good. Projects fairly well. Um, on cold, it smelled amazing. I got this in a employee sale, one of those grab bag sales, I believe. So that's why I had that and I just wanted to finish it off. Uh, we, I kind of used it as like my bathtub candle, honestly, for the most part. Um, but we have a lot of candles in this video today too. So that was the first candle that we finished off. With. My youngest daughter finished off so many single wicks that I hardly have any left. She suddenly got interested in candles and now I hardly have any single wicks left. She finished off uh, fresh cut lilacs and this does not have the scent notes on it. And this was like the tester candle that they had. I got this in another employee. Um, I think this was my first MOS haul and she finished off fresh or wonder. So she finished off a lot of these, unfortunately, and it breaks my candle loving heart, but it is what it is. So she finished off Pure Wonder. Uh, let me see. Um, a declutter. I am decluttering this really old bottle of Dark Kiss. This, um, I don't know how old this is. But uh, Angela at Boots and Mascara, she had started talking about... Um, when your spray starts smelling like just alcohol and this one does it just smells like alcohol that that's how you kind of know how they've gone bad so i'm decluttering it finally i do have a mini in the newer dark kiss and i'm okay with just the mini but i'm just off a CeraVe foaming facial cleanser for normal to oily skin because we go through like several of these a month uh let's see i finished off a dove advanced care dry spray have some dust on it sorry about that i love these i prefer the dove sprays pretty much over any other brand i finished that i'm decluttering this bloomfield foot mask i never used it it is most definitely gone bad i mean it, it's it's like five years old so i'm just decluttering that because i never used it i'm gonna declutter this vanilla uh vanilla bean noel that my daughter had decluttered because you really you can't smell anything with this one i think it was just because of the year that it was but you can't you can't smell anything get two mascaras this one is dried up it's the it cosmetic superhero and then my maybelline sky high i will probably go repurchase this one um, just haven't done it yet, but they're really old, so I needed to declutter them. Another thing of the Equate 5 Blades. You guys see them every month. A Dove Anti-Stress Bar. Finished off this, so I have no idea what happened to the cap. But it is the Suave Micellar Infusion 201 Daily. We finished off that. We finished off the Somebody Loves You. This is so cute. This was Chris Apple's Sunkissed Melon and Sugar Crystals. We finished off that. I loved it. Um, I don't know that I would repurchase it, but it smelled really good. We finished off a cocktail garden. This one everyone really loved. This is Muddled Mint, Sparkling Lime, and Ginger Soda. I think it's the ginger notes and like the soda notes that we all really, really love. But we finished off that. We finished off a Dove Pink Bar. Um, I have so many, uh, Bath and Body Works bags. We're just gonna, here's another single wick that my daughter finished. She finished Glacier Mist. The Secret Spray is empty. I'm not gonna repurchase these sprays from Secret. They just don't perform the same way that the Dove sprays do. So this is the Lash Princess, the waterproof one. It's super old. I need to restock my, uh, my makeup. Um, almond blossom, hand soap. This was almond milk, coriander, and vanilla sugar. It was okay. Nothing too exciting. Apparently a box. Uh, the Elvi L'Oreal Color Vibrancy because my youngest daughter colors your hair like every other 
month almost. A room spray, amazing. And this one is Sunrise Woods. So we finished that. This Milk Makeup Blush. This one, I'm trying to read, I think it says work or something. I, I have no idea what color it was, but it's probably like seven, eight years old. So why are we keeping that? Um, conditioner tube from a Dove Restoring Bar. I really liked this one. This is the coconut and cocoa butter. So we used one of those, we love that. Oh my goodness, what is in here? Um, oh, okay, so that's why I put them all in a big bag. Finish the Soft Soap Body Coconut Oil and Calming Lavender. Finish a Head and Shoulders Dry Scalp Care. And, okay, this is why I put this in like another bag. So we finished off one of the Japanese Cherry Blossom uh, Creamy Body Scrubs. When I opened, I guess like when I first started trying to use this one and I would squeeze it, the top or at the top busted open. So this went through super, super fast, but that's why it was another in another bag because it was just a mess. Um, I've never had a creamy body scrub do that before. I thought that was interesting that the top kind of like opened up and everything, but it finished off a five pack one two three four five yeah five pack of the colgate toothpaste so she finished eucalyptus rain raspberries and whipped vanilla sweet pea she finished off sweet pea she and then this is my um special shampoo for my psoriasis these are all of my wallflower buds bulbs sorry we went through white iris and cedarwood, blue ocean waves, stress relief, and strawberry, which one? Strawberry blossoms. And then those are just the empty cartridge. This one in pineapple mango. Yes, that was okay. Fresh pineapple juice and mango and vine wrap and raspberry. These were okay. Um, then uh, Lavender Clouds is the one that we like the best out of this label. The label that looked like those. We liked the lavender one. Cluttering these, finally, these are the Bath and Body Works Antibacterial Hand Wipes in Eucalyptus Mint. These are so old, guys. They are dried up. I don't know why I thought I would still keep them, but I, I finished off in It Cosmetics CC Plus Nude Glow. It Cosmetics is probably the one brand that I turn to cosmetics-wise over and over and over again and I cannot stop rebuying and um I love them I, I love almost everything that they come out with but because of my lupus and because of my rosacea that's why I think I love them so much but I finished off that and that was the color in like I think it was like fair ivory yeah and when was the expiration date oh I think it expired January or something but I finished that we finished off a lavender and vanilla sleep uh, bubble bath and foam bath body wash. Finished off one of those. Finished off another candle. This one was Sweet Pea. So we finished that one. And Sweet Pea is, let me see. Sweet Pea Water Repair Sheer Sheer Freesia Luscious Raspberry. It's really good. I highly recommend We finished off White Waves. Sea spray, white peony, and salted amber. So we finished up one of those. Uh, oh, okay, name brand here. Soleil Sensitive Razors. And then a wallflower plug. Oh my gosh, you guys. Okay, let me get all the way down here. And then that's the end of our empties for this month. I am finally decluttering this NARS blush it was like a travel trial size. I barely used it at all, but it is so old, guys, so old. So I had to declutter that. And this breaks my heart, but I'm finally doing it. I am finally decluttering my Urban Decay demolition pencil. I'm gonna bite the bullet. And this month I'm gonna buy a new one, but I'm finally decluttering it. I mean, I just, I can't, I can barely even sharpen this anymore and it's just time to let it go. So I'm doing it. And then last but not least, my daughter finished a votive in this 
Aeropostle, it's berries and cream, and then it has like a little strawberry label on it. It was super cute. She got in like a Christmas gift. She finished that. So guys, <laughs> that was a huge amount of empties for March. And I really, I really appreciate you guys helping me to stay on track. March was an amazing month for my empties, obviously. And guys, I will see you in my next video. Bye, friends. And if you liked videos like the one that you just saw, do me a favor, guys. Please click subscribe. It's free to you. It allows me to kind of make more content for you guys. Comment, like, subscribe, share with your friends so that we can keep our friendship kind of growing and invite more people into our YouTube fam. But I really appreciate all the time that you guys take watching and commenting on my videos. I've made some amazing friends and I'd like to be your friend too. Bye guys! move too fast, honey. We're pictures. Not me again.